with the, his legs, so Pirates have to find a way to minimize this run. All right, straight handoff, bursting through, big run. The tailback, number 35, Wesley Gray's burst for the back. 18 to pass formation is second and six. Wide receiver was just wiggling. All right, jet sweep. Coming to the outside, one man blocks two. This is Ahmad Ross to the house. Touchdown, a team that doesn't score, scores what? in four plays. It's, what a perfect game against Delaware. All right, man in motion, straight handoff. Neither team made it on the team bus, evidently, because Sellis with just one back. And we're calling the same number again. A first down run, gain of six. Maybe our first pass of the day. Sellis stands, steps back, gets rushed, flushed out of the pocket. He's good at this. Ah, first down, nice run on the broken. 371 yards rushing for Zella, so over 1,300 yards between passing and throwing. Uh, another long run right up to the, the play action here. This is handoff to the running back, number five. That's a lot. 11.28 to go in the first quarter, 7-0 A&T. He keeps working, keep trying it. No gain on the play. has gone for the all-silver trimmed in white and blue. Sells calls for the handoff. Sees a man wide open. Complete. Pass complete to number six. Man in motion. Sells claps his hands a second time. Handoff. This is our fourth running back, and he's just as good as all the other ones. Big run. Number 31. Jaquan Snipes. Awful. They have a little bit different running styles. You have the big bully back. And a couple of wide outs. Okay, pass to to the tight end, number 88, Evan King. Evan Phillips has got the play. Claps his hand. It's a pass. Got three receivers, one in the corner. And the only one open was an A&T defender. A little miscommunication between the right receiver and the quarter if the Pirates can't move the chains. Phillips claps his hand, calls his own number, and a great play in on the tackle, number eight. On the blitz, the line falls down. The punter holds. Kick is up, and it is good. And with eight minutes and 15 seconds to go in the second quarter, seven. If you can't hear us, folks, we apologize. The AT and T band just showed up, and they are in full throat of telling us they're here, walking around Armstrong Field. Loss of two. All right, tight end motion. Uh, that should be a flag because he turned up field too quick, but guess what? Now that I say they never throw a pass, they throw a pass and it's complete. So that was White hitting his best. This is he against the pass and haven't done great against the run as well. Hand off, awful left guard, gain of four on the play, tough running. Marching down the field. Straight handoff. This is the big back. He buries his way for four yards, five five yards. Give him four. Go from the left side to the right side. Hampton shifts on defense. Straight handoff. Nice cut. Well done, sir. That's the running back number seven, Christian. This is where AT might get a little gambling and try to throw one long. That's exactly the idea, but it's a dump off pass. A good one. White finds. They have Townsend next week, and then they go to Rhode Island, and they finish the season in Campbell. All right. Pirate defense stands strong on second downs. A loss on the play. That run second. All right. Run blitz for Pirates. They call the run blitz. It's the right thing to do, but the offensive line for A&T too strong. They push the pile. They have to do. Excellent. All right. First and 10, Aggies straight off handoff. Boy, that offensive line blocking so well. In on that block, number 68. Have to continue this dominant run offense. All right, pass, looking at one. Ran before he caught the ball. Coach ought to make him do elite. The only, the only stop on that, uh, that whole series was the quarterback being tackled for loss. Right. So the battering ram for the Pirates, number 35, Tymere Robinson. He's got a majority of the carry so far. Looking good, gets one safety. 
15 yards off the ball. That leaves a lot of room for the running backs because there's no safety come up near to whack them. But the A&T uh, defensive line says, well, we play of the quarter, 19 seconds to go, man in motion, straight handoff. Not much creativity here for the Pirates. That was Burris, and Burris ran 30 yards east and with Pirates. Salas claps his hands, gets the ball, pass, man wide open, complete. That's Copeland. So Zellis is close to a thousand yard passing this year. He's missed a game. Good thing for the Pirates, he's back in. He's throwing the ball well. Gain of two, sack, gain of three. Second and seven, is tight end in motion. Tight end resets. Faked handoff, looking for that tight end on a wheel route. Oh, great pitch and catch. Can he stay on his feet? He does, but he's out of bounds. Great throw. So that was TK Tyson. 23. Copeland in the motion. Ooh, upended. Player locks his helmet. That was number eight. When you get flipped over on your head like that. Right. Fake to him. Stop and go pass. That's got to be a flag. No, says the official. Kamari Gray. Quarterback. Sellis with the cadence. Bring command in motion. Uh, kind of a missed handoff. I'm not sure everybody knew what the play was. Gain of the play of two will be fourth. Might have gone for it. This kick of 33 yards. It's up and right down the middle. So this is why we don't get paid the big coaching by the <laughs> Clearly not. Pirates close the gap. It's 7 6 after. But they do have an up back just behind the right guard. So that's where they run. They run right behind the half back. And the up back blows the block. Hampton sniffs it out. Great play by the Pirates. Defense can do here on this third drive to start stop so the they run. They made a lot of changes. Scheme-wise, both uh, both defenses have done well on the second and third drives here. It'll be interesting to have time changes. Now the offense will probably chat. Right. Pirates in a prevent defense, seven defensive backs, and we rushed four on the play. They don't get to him wide open. Number 18, Tamon Cook. There wasn't a Pirate around. That's hard to deal with. Money throw. That was a money throw. First down in Hampton Territory at the 40. And now that the pass runs, now the safeties can't come crashing down. It's at least two defensive backs to take down the big tailback. White calls his own number. I'm not sure this was read option on purpose, but it turned out to be read option, especially from his own band. Yeah. All right. White in the shotgun, fakes the handoff. Looking deep, wide open, intercepted. Underthrown ball. Number three, the intended receiver, Monte Jones, is stripped. If you look at the replay, Tama Cook is wide open wide on that open left plus. side. And this fellow was not open. He's calling for the flag. No, but I don't think he wants to hear the band when he's trying to call out the snap count. So Pirates were down here for this Pirates team. They can get some yards here. I know Coach Nickelberry plays his Madden. <laughs> this is real life. You got to pound the rock sometimes. Yeah. Pounding the rock are the Pirates. Good run. Now Snipes is in the backfield joining Zealous. We've seen Snipes a couple times on third down. It's just Zealous with a great play fake. He breaks through around the left side. Gain. Starting quarterback being the third leading rusher, but he's really good at it. Close to 400 yards this year. Pass on the fan. He finds the guy, breaks it open. Can he go all the way? No, just barely pushed out of bound. Tied in on the left side in H back formation. Zealous is looking at it. That same tight end and way overthrows. All right, once again. Four wide outs and a tight end jet sweep. The wide outs kind of just watch the, uh, watch the play develop. Exactly. Zealous gets the play call from the sideline. Looks one way, looks the other way. Finds the guy in the middle. Good pass right on the money. It'll be short of the, of the down to gain. Under throws the ball is picked off by Hampton, but he throws the wrong guy. Aggies in a power. Formation, just run it up the middle, gain of one. 
Second and nine. It's a great day to be an Aggie. They lead 7-6. Right. Read option. Uh, wrong option. Sack on the play. DeAndre Falk says, hey, second and 16 for the Aggies. Blitz picked up by the offense. Run. They ran away from the blitz. That is football 101. You run away from the blitz. Gain a free catch spot. Zellis claps his hand twice. Straight hand off. Breaks it. Great run. Elijah Burris founds a hole off left guard. Get a little electrified. Read option. Flag on the play. I'm sure this is going to be holding. Zellis called his pirates after the holding penalty. Muff snap. Zealous is trying to kill the crowd with there was like seven heart attacks on that last play for him trying to pick up the ball like a hot potato. Calls his own number, Zealous. Gains nine on the play. I'm looking for Hampton to call timeout here. It's going to be third down. 34 seconds now. They burnt the whole 40 second clock. And now they throw? Nice catch there. Well, that worked just fine, I guess. That was Paul Woods with his first catch of the day. Gain on the play, enough for first down. Six here. Three would be fine, but he would always take six over three. Calls his own number, Zealous. Can he get to the corner? He dives. Out of bounds, out of bounds. With 12 seconds to go, Zealous on a good keep. All right, after the penalty. Zealous looks, throws it. It's caught on the deflection. Number 30, Gregory Featherstone tips it to Hampton. Touchdown, touchdown, Pirates. Oh, what a play there. Look at the replay. Look how the receiver is able Catches to. Catches it, doesn't catch it, doesn't catch it, doesn't catch it. He got it. The build. In motion. Fake handoff, not fooling a and t Oh, well done. Batted down. Nice play by the defensive back. No good on the two-point conversion. Then, wonder if he's going to kick it short again. He's kicked it off short the last three times. Oh, it's going to be kind of a scrum kick, and it's going to work. Oh, yeah. Onside kick yeah. caught. Oh. oh, time out, time out. Time out. What a job. The onside kick recovered by number 20. Five seconds to go. Zealous is going to look long. He's got plenty of blocking. He throws a perfect spiral looking for his receiver. Knocked down. Incomplete. Yeah, nearly caught there. Nearly nice. caught. That was number 16. Five yards is like giving that Kit Kat to that kid. He didn't deserve it. All right, Jet Sweet. Here's Copeland. Cuts it up. Nicely done. Good move. Yard trying to get a place. Gain of seven. Jet Sweet's worked well. They can do it in the second half. No, the, the last time they ran the little tunnel screen, Hampton didn't block very well. That time they did. Now a first down run. That was Burris getting the f tough four yards, moving the chains. First in. And now it's a little warm. Playing on Astro Turf could all add up. Zealous hits the tight end on a scene pattern. Big gain on the play. First down. Pirates. Evan King with his third great. Pirates at the A&T 18. Keeper, read option a little bit. Oh, this time King can't haul it in. He's wide open. He was covered by number one. Number 31, Jaquan Snipe. We've been seeing him a lot in the slot and also tailback. They don't throw it to him this time. But he might get a, play, a block on the play. He does get a block on the play. This is the almost accidental... Reverse the field in the history of football. That was number 11. Ramon Copeland reverse flags. First down on the play after Copeland runs forever. Handoff, straight handoff to Snipes. Snipes gets four on the play. It'll be second and goal at the 10, at the five. Or a quick draw. Maybe a QB draw here. No, read option. Burst gets the handoff. So we're gonna do a little tush pushing. Not enough tush pushing. Gets it down to the one, though. It'll be third. So let's we'll see what they do. Zellis claps his head only one time. Read option. Keeps it himself. 
Did he make the right call? No, a and defense, strong at the line. Juan Price, he dives, Burris dives, gets the ball, dives in. I don't think he gets it. No signal from the linesman. He played for both squads. Burris gets the rock, cuts up field. Touchdown, Hampton. This play, may be reviewed, folks. This is the runner's elbow was down, and the ball did not make the goal line. This will be a turnover on down. It'll be first and ten for NCAA team. Team to go, first and ten Aggies, and we're just White's just going to keep it. Just trying to get out of the out of the end zone. The quarter. This time, handoff. Gain of three on the play. AT is just trying to get out of the shadow of their own. Third and five for the Aggies. They just run it again. And here come the Blybergers stuffing the run. It'll be a gain of three on the play, but it'll be fourth down. Burris gets the handoff. Running hard, nice play, good tackle. And on the tackle for the Aggies, number 14, Herbert Hooker. He comes up with good offense when you go back. Yeah, just like that, the Pirates are in a tough position offensively. Zealous, oh, there's going to be a flag. I'm, yeah, there it is. Number one, Karan, he was just gone. And the safety did the only thing he could do, pull the foul it out. All right. New tail back in for the Pirates. That's number 44, Quentin Johnson. We haven't seen him since the first quarter. He splins off. Make a have to take advantage of the low possession they they've have. They've thrown well. They've passed well. They just haven't taken done the right thing on. I believe that is a catch. Yeah, TK a lets you interpret what happened here. Pirates are going quick. They know that might have been not have been. A catch, and so zealous off of. I mean, they haven't converted four red zone trips today. You're right. Pass, caught, touchdown. T. K. Payson. Payson with a big grab earlier, two plays ago, and now he finds pay dirt. Probably the easy. Hamptons had pretty easy time on on defense most of the second quarter, and only to one. There's the play. Broke it wide open. Touchdown, 75 yards. White hits Christian. No one in America near Christian on that. NT was kind of looking like they were just kind of packing up the house. And a quick strike, they're right back in it. Good kick. This will be the second back. And uh-oh, we're gone. This will be 97 yards to the house. That is Ramon Copeland untouched, unbothered, and with six in his pocket. Special playmaker on the special team side. All right. Aggies have decided they're now a throwing offense. Ball's thrown out to the left flat. Christian, ball was thrown to his outside shoulder. He looked over his inside shoulder. Scoreboard shows 26-20. That's not right. Handoff. This is Christian, keeps his feet. He's around the left end. Gains 20 on a play, tough run. Weiss directing traffic. Fakes the handoff. A single receiver screen. For a team that doesn't throw the ball, only 50 some odd yards, they look efficient today. 50 yard run. The most he's ever had in the completions is eight against Villanova on 17 attempts. His high in passing for the whole year. Wow. 96 yards. Wow. The zone with a deep safety. He's going to throw it even with a deep zone. He had a guy wide open and a second one wide open underneath the coverage. The ball was complete to number here. Oh, the scoreboard finally agrees with me. How about that? Handoff right up the gut. Big, strong run. Kenji Christian, who's looked very, very good today, crashes right into the line. Last week, he only had a minute 43 to go here in the third. 
Driving are the Aggies. Handoff. Oh, he keeps it twice. A great read option. Great job. Kevin White fakes it to the fullback, pulls the ball back, fakes it. Cole Christensen, especially Christensen, uh, getting passes or part of the repart, read option. Pass short. His favorite, White's favorite receiver, number one, Jerkari Caldwell. You made a comment on the play, second and three for the Aggies, deep in Pirate territory. Wow. Pass overthrown, intended for Team and Cook. Knocked out the ball boy almost. Uh, three anymore. So two down territory for the Aggies, we think. A little inside handoff, well defended by the Pirates. Time to shine, his mom wants to see him kick. Ball's put down, Daffer busts the ball right down the middle. He's a very good kicker. He's, he's kept a t in it with his ex five or 40 seconds of the clip. He shortened the game up quite a bit. Handoff, this is number 31. Jake one snipe, we've seen him a lot in the second half. That's the time. Good job by Zealous to let it burn. But maybe some of that fatigue we talked about earlier, two hammers from the Pirate. They have played very well today. Hand off. This is Burris. He bounces off the entire defensive line and then in on the play. Loss on the play. Tackle by number 13 here on Homecoming. You're watching Flow Sports. I'm Dave Strickland. With Kyan Nickelberry on commentary. You heard him call the sweep. Coach Nickelberry had the right play call. First down for the top to stop the ball. I do think that takes away a bit of strategy, though. By Lots just of strategy it. goes away. You're exactly right. Well, strategy the Pirates are using right now, we're going to run, run, and we're going to run a little bit more, and a good, good thing. Oh, reverse. Zealous is being the true quarterback. He did not block a little <laughs> any bit at all. That way. No, no, that's not my job. Continue to chew this clock off. Next week, Hampton goes to Arano, Maine to play the Black Bears. Then they're home to William & Mary. Nice rivalry. Uh, Interstate 6 No reason to even run a play here. No, well, decided to go ahead and run a play. And it's intercepted. Number 21, oh, everybody's going to take it to the house. This will wow. be a return for touchdown. 80 yards on the pick six. David Laney, the guy who made the great tackle on third down, sticking the uh, bird flag, the sideline warning. Yes, we enjoyed it. There's the tip. That was intended for Evan King. Pass return. We've had long pass plays. We have everything but departures in a pair of trade. Yeah, we've seen a lot of big plays here from both teams. And it's been an exciting game, and this is what we want to see for a homecoming play. Now, Zealous has been burning all the clock down. This time he burned it all 35 seconds. It was all the way down to five. Pitches is out. This is Snipes. Snipes around Russian where that ball is being uh, pitched to because it's kind of a blind pitch. Flag on the plate. It's another free play here. Passes way overthrown. Zealous throws it into the third deck. But there's a flag. 840 on the game clock. Pirates only lead by two. Big run. Snipes. Move the chains. That's a first down for Jamal Jaquan Snipes. The old scraps. <laughs> Handoff straight up the middle. Guess what? A different tailback. And Quinton Johnson laying the wood there. Gain of nine on the play. That safe drive alive. I did not print out the CA re report on penalties, but I got a feeling both of these squads uh, see a lot of the long. What a &T needs. Now Zealous and the Pirates need a first down. Four-man rush, picked up. Pass falls incomplete, intended for on the field. And for a non-passing team, 
Folks, we're not kidding you when a t is not a passing team, and they're just having it. They're way throwing the ball. And the player we've been looking at has in the third quarter stands next to the quarterback, White. Pushes in, gets the carry, gain of one. Nice tackle on the play with zone. A and T direct handoff Christensen. Once again, well, how many times have we said Christensen untouched until like four or five yards on a pair on carry? You have to give credit to the all. Stay for a kick. That'd be 42 yard kick. Uh oh, sack! No, ball gets tipped and falls incomplete. First time in a while they didn't full throw. Handoff Christensen. Fumble on the play. Fumble on the play. Yes, the ball's on the ground. Referee signal. Christensen dropped the ball. Uh, all the players are celebrating with Stanley Gardner. Johnny on the spot. And we see, yep, there's the ball. And there's Gardner right on the money. Hampton's going to run, 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 and run some more. Keeper. Zealous keeps the ball. Keeps it. Inbounds, gain seven on the play. Good first down call, save. He brings a man in motion. Hands off to Burris. Burris is stood up. Good tackle in on the play. Number eight. In the first half. Yeah, right at the end of the first half. You're right, exactly right. Keeper, zealous. That'll probably do it. Great call. Very safe call. Let no one else touch the ball besides zealous. Handoff, Burris. Keeps his legs churning, but good ball security. Has the ball tucked right underneath his rib cage. Gains five on the play. Keeper, that's a, that's a smart play. Keeps the clock running, forcing the Aggies to call timeout. They do. Now is They blitz. Read option. Burris breaks free. Touchdown. No. A late Touchdown saving tackle. Burris thought he had it. He was raising his hand. Two great teams here. To, uh, great rivalry between these two teams. And what a way for Hampton to end this homecoming with a win. So, Pirates take a knee. We've got water.